Very good. Thanks a lot for that, both of you. Now, if you're a regular viewer, you know there's a lot of talk about what I wear for the show every year for the Countdown Show. Well, this year, I got some fashion advice from a New York basketball legend, a little Purple Rain, I think. He knows a lot about style. We're talking about Walt Clyde Frazier. How you doing? All right, what's up? You're supposed to tell me when you walked yeah. in. Oh, yeah? And so that you know, but you're, you're ready. Wait, you're not going to have me wear this on New Year's Eve. No, no, I have some stuff. Oh, okay, all right. What's up, man? Okay, so I'm going to get that red one. Yeah. That looks sharp. But a lot of times on New Year's Eve, people have asked me, hey, did Walt pick that out for you? I have all my tux, and I'm ready to go. Now, careful what you wish for. Oh, <laughs> not the cow print. They want me to wear the cow print. No way. For years, you've been dressing up to make sure you make a statement. The other teens, when they came to New York, they wore their finest clothes, trying to outdress the Knicks. And what do you think the secret will be for me for New Year's Eve to make that statement? Something right. with pizzazz. I like that. <laughs> pizzazz. Pizzazz. <laughs> but you're going to be illuminating and devastating. Wow, what is Dean wearing? <laughs> They're going to say, Dean is a dream. <laughs> <laughs> it's a dream. I mean, our relationship or the family relationship goes back 50 years. I know. Can you believe it? Some people don't realize that my dad played with you, you know, on that 73 championship you, team. This is sharp, dude. You did that in a suit. The whole suit, you think? Yeah, yeah, that would be the whole suit. See, but this is subtle. Subtle? Yeah, this is quiet. But then you have all these. The purple, the yellow goes, the red goes. They're going to be talking. That's a champagne bubbly right there. <laughs> Remember, it's Clyde for the night. It's Clyde for the night. <laughs> well, we're going to do it. If they love it, I'm going to take credit for it. If they don't like it, I'm going to say I'm Clyde for the night. <laughs> All right. We're on our way. Oh, boy. All right. Make sure to let us know what you think about my tux on social media by using the hashtag NYE on NY1. The clock is ticking as we get closer and closer to midnight. We'll bring you back to Times Square in a little bit. But before we go to a quick break, actress Emily Blunt tells us why New Year's just isn't her thing while the rest of us are celebrating big time.